Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Adlina Shafika Bintadaha and my metric number is 190342. And this is my first assignment for the digital signal processing subject, which is to familiarize with Scilab. And this is the task that I need to do, uh, which is to go through the provided links to install and learn how to use Scilab. Use sine width with frequency of 1 hertz to compose square, triangle, and sawtooth width and plot each harmony and approximated wave. Record your voice in my name is name in wave format. Replace name with your own name. Use silent console to do the following. Load the wave file. In example, wave read. Plot the sound signal in example plot. Print the wave file sample frequency and beat rate. Record your screen and voice performing step 2 and 4. So the first us, which is to create the square, triangle, and sort of face. This is the coding which I get from the internet. And then uh, I use the save wave function to create the wave file of this square width, and I save it as Alina square width. Uh, the uh, RMKC is the color code for each plot, and G is the color for the plot of square wave. So when I execute, it will produce this harmonic square wave in the in green. So next, we move to the triangle wave. This is the coding and the wave file created by the safe wave. And when I execute, it will produce this triangle wave in the green. And then for the sawtooth wave. This is the coding, and then this is the uh, safe wave function, which is Adina sawtooth width. And when I execute, it will produce this sawtooth width in the green, which look like a saw. So the file is created. The wave file created for the uh, this three wave is here. Alina sawtooth, Alina square wave, and Alina triangle wave. So this is the sixth file that is needed, which is the plot and the wave file. Next, we move to the next task, which is to record the name, which is my name is Adlina, and then load the wave file in the console. So first, we open the console and change the directory where we store the uh, our recorded wave file. After we enter the directory, I will use wave coding and declare the axis y load the my wave file my file name is adlina wave and then it will produce this column and we need to wait until it reached 300,000. So I will pause here. Okay. Until it has reached at 300,000. Okay, it has finished. So after it has finished running, then we enter. We need to plot the. Uh, wave signal so we we need to plot the wave signal read plot the sound signal so we need to insert the coding plot plot 2d y 1 500,000 
and then the, here is the sound signal the, the plot for the sound signal which is my and then there is a pause name pause is pause adlina and the bit is 16 and this is the sampling frequency this is the sampling frequency and this is the bit which is 16 so i guess that's all for me and that's all the tasks that i need to do and record it um thank you for watching